Welcome to another Windows 8 video. Today we are going to talk about the mail app in Windows 8 and how to actually add or remove accounts in that mail app. Uh, in Windows 8 there is a great great leap forward in how mail accounts are actually installed with a very nice feature of uh, having all the types of accounts possible. What's cool is that the mail app actually has very little settings that you will tweak to actually make your mail work. So how do you add or remove accounts? First of all, when you installed Windows 8 for the first time and started your computer for the first time, it asked you for an email address and that email is the start email that will usually be already in your mail app. So go on the mail tile app click on it and here I have my learn Windows 8 which is the official Windows 8 uh, Gmail address but maybe you don't want that address maybe you want to add another account how do you do that the only you need to do is when you're in your mail app go on one of the right corners lower or upper for the charms and there you will go into settings once there you've got accounts and that's where you'll click and you'll see that the Gmail accounts that are associated with your uh, computer here are my uh, learn Windows 8 now Gmail account which is associated here if I want to add an account you've got the little add account here right below it that you'll click and it's gonna ask you what type of account you want you've got uh, already configured if you want Hotmail and Google accounts or Outlook Exchange type accounts but if it's none of those you'll just click other accounts and depending on the accounts you've got more or less details to give out so all you need to do is for example I want to add a Google account well I'll just click Google add the email address add the password and that's it or if I want to add an Hotmail, well, all I need to do is just uh, click in add an account, add your Hotmail account. Same thing, just the email address and password. Everything is done pretty much on its own. It synchronizes your mail and it's pretty neat. But it does not download the messages and remove them from the servers. And that's nice because you can still access those messages unless of course you've deleted the messages then they will be uh, unavailable if you have an account that you want to remove all you need to do is when you're in your mail app actually go into the upper corners or the lower corner on the right click the settings go into accounts click that account that you want to remove for example I want to remove this Gmail account what do I do you just go on the bottom here on the right side and go into remove account I'll click here and here goes my account has been removed so that's as easy as that usually it's pretty cool for that uh, keep in mind that most accounts will not need much information they are almost automatically configured but sometimes you can be asked for the outgoing ingoing servers of that account so you need try to have all that information Andy in case you in case you really need to put all the information so that was how to add and remove accounts in the mail app in Windows 8 if you enjoyed these videos click the subscribe button at the top of the screen you'll be informed of all the videos we put online if you have any comments questions maybe a request of a video you'd like to see let us know and we'll try to put that online for you so thanks for watching bye bye